for your next pair. Wade dialed in 624 to an 809 for Hunter. So again, if you won the first two rounds of the Gamblers race, we need round three back to the lanes, please. Round three of the Gamblers, need you there, please. Big time starting line advantage, gonna go to Giles. He's on through and get the win light. Wade Giles out of Roseland, Virginia, coming back in round three of the Gamblers. Next up, Logan Martin and David Spa. Logan dialed in 687 to a 660 for Spa. Six now, the difference between Spa and Martin. Win light gonna go to David Spa. 17th down margin at the top end over Logan Martin. Joe Dedrick and Tom Scrifignano. And the red light for Dedrick gonna end his day. Tom Skrifignano will be your winner. Seven flat on the 696. Tucker Creech and Tanner Miller, your next pair. Tanner dialed in a 613. Six forty-eight dial in for Creech. Folks, got a pair. We got our buy run and then our ATI Performance Products Saturday main event final coming at you in just a few minutes. We have called round two gambler winners to the lanes, please. <clears throat> Miller to the top end, gets beat. Win light, gonna go to Tucker Creech. Here comes your buy run, Dawson Wiggins. Wiggins dialed in a 580. Double O three on the red side for Dawson. 581 with a one on the 580. Well, folks, here comes your ATI Performance Products main event final.
Here they are, ladies and gentlemen, your final. ATI Performance Products Saturday Main Event Final. Bobby Matera out of Waldorf, Maryland. <clears throat> the Buick Opal dialed in 567. Up against Nick Hastings trying to double up. He already won the Friday event earlier today when we finished it up. Now he's trying to double up. Trying to hog the shirt, man. Bobby Matera would love to put that Calvert Kettle Horn Corn Opal on next year's shirt. 567, the dial in for Matera. 607 for Hastings. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, place your bets. Double O two to a twenty one, folks. Double up. No, Bobby Matera gets the win. Hastings lets him around by a foul. Bobby Matera dead on with the one. Absolutely incredible final.
Mark Hunter and Pete Bushnell. Derek Thompson, again, Derek Thompson sitting on the bye. He was trip zip in round number three. Again, this is round three. If you're not in the lanes, you're late because we're running round three now. Mark Hunter, Pete Bushnell. Stewart Smokehouse 72 Poison Pinto. Six bow advantage for the Punto. And Mark's going to round four. Next up, Duck Davis and Jake Narr. Once again, we are running round number three of the gamblers. If you're not here, you're late. They're going down now, round three. Duck Davis, Jake Narr. Finish line comes up, it's gonna be Jake Narr, 619 with a nine, getting a W. Doug Davis getting the win, uh, beat on that last one. Now we got Jessica Biddle and Tommy Borgia. Borgia out of Lawrenceburg, Kentucky. Stick shifted Mustang. 753 to dial in. 635 for Jessica. Jessica turns it red. Borgia going to round four. 634 for Jessica. 108. Borgia coming back. Chris Valentino and Corey Griffith, Battle of the Third Gens. Corey dialed in at a 668 out of Alliance, Ohio. Bill Performance, a Bruzy Transmissions Converters. Wired to win. All part of uh, the help that Corey's got and Chris Valentino down 639. Danielsville, Pennsylvania. His Camaro one year older than Corey's in 85. And Valentino goes red. Corey Letzer eats 669, 103, 639, dead seventh for Valentino. Jay Norris, 640 dial in versus Nikki Thomas is 617. Finish line comes up. Win light will go to Jay Norris on the double breakout. He's eight thou under, two two hundreds under.
Tell you, Dawson Wiggins is in a good spot on the tree right now. Getting the win over Trish Witt and parking her for the night. Wendell Giles, Andrew Marr, your next pair. Marr dialed in 626 to 731 for Wendell. When light will go to Drew Marr, Wendell under by 9,000, trying to get there, is still behind by 9,000. Next up, the pinnel wagon, Tyler Hall versus Nick Shekelhoff. Advantage for the man from Canfield, Ohio. Shekelhoff puts the wind light on. 647 on the 45. 103 miles an hour. Tyler bows out. 37 on the 35 at 89 miles an hour. Randy Cooper and Jesse Betterton, your next pair. Jesse dialed in 529 to a 534 for Cooper. Again, a couple of really fast side-by-side -side door cars coming off the foot. Trip zip for Cooper. Can't make it work. Couldn't get there. Win light gonna go to Jesse Betterton. 530 on the 29. Andrew Adkins and Wade Giles, your next pair. Wade dialed in 627 to a 759 for Adkins. Absolute final call for round three. If you're not there, I don't know where you're at. Literally, I don't. 009 to 001. Adkins was good, gets the win light. One too many whomps for Giles, gives it back by 2,000. Wade is not going to be happy with himself. Dave Harvey Jr. and Harrison Crawford. Crawford dialed in 630 to a 676 for Harvey. Harvey's got the top ball knocked out. Yeah. 
Glenn Light will go to David Harvey Jr. 6.77 with 9 on the 76. Crawford closer to the dial, but further from the reaction time. Next up, Bob Mullaney and Tucker Creech. Mullaney gonna dial in 629, Tucker 648. You'll see, see the pre-stage ball just go out again. Red light for Creech ends his night. Bob Mullaney will continue on. 6.27 on the 29. David Spawn, Tom Scriffick, Nano. Scriffick, Nano, out 7.01 to a 6.60 for Spawn. Just two thousand difference between Spa and Scrippignano. We might gonna go for Spa. Derek Thompson on the bye. Shots are down early, 597 after a 29 red. Cutting edge technology, attention to detail, and rigorous testing under race conditions are the principles that make ATI Performance products great. For more than half a century, we've been helping racers like you reach the finish line first. Today, we manufacture a wide range of high performance parts that are track tested and race proven. We're passionate about performance, and we want to make our passion your performance. Get the whole ATI Performance product story at atiracing.com.
do believe we have our racers back and ready to go, getting them suited up and ready for round number four. And again, congratulations, win or lose this round, you got money coming. Well, I guess we're waiting on a few cars. Tommy Borgia and Jake Narr are going to start things off. Kentucky versus Pennsylvania. Borgia in Lawrenceburg, Kentucky, 756 dial in. Up against Jake Narr, One Sky Media. SNL Signs helping out the Vega. Jake uh, doing a little car hopping. Borgia, the stick shifted Mustang. Getting ready to move in on the OK Sales and Recycling side of the racetrack, Carolina No Time Productions. Side is Jake Narr. 14 cars left in the Gamblers. And going to round five is the stick shifted car, Tommy Borgia. Your winner, 752 on the 56. Now Mark Hunter and Nick Shekelhoff. Shekelhoff dialed 645. There's 746 for Hunter in the Poison Pino. Both racers getting ready to bump it in. Just fourth down difference between Hunter and Shekeloff. It's going to be Mark Hunter moving on. Fourth down margin of victory over Shekeloff. And, uh, Nick's going to have to park it for the night. Next up, Dave Harvey Jr. and David Spa. A couple of crafty veterans going at it here. 677 dial in for Harvey, 660 
for Spa. Well, sometimes you gotta be crafty because you weren't necessarily great. Win like gonna go to Spa. Both of them dead on with a seven. Advantage by five thou at the starting line is what won it for David Spa. Now Andrew Adkins and Jesse Betterton. The fastest car left and the slowest car left, but of course, uh, Adkins, bad dude. He has been a uh, champion, World Foot Brake Challenge champion. Betterton's won a whole bunch of stuff over the years, including a couple of our races. In the Rodney McCroskey own Camaro. Down advantage and the win light going to Betterton. 28 with a three on the 28. Atkins got there first by a foul. Had to break out by 10 thou to accomplish it. Jay Norris and Derek Thompson. Derek Thompson dialed in 568 to the 639 for Jay Norris. Norris, the Inman Auto Sales, Plymouth Duster, Paul's transmission also helping him out. Derek Thompson, he's out of White Sulphur Springs, West Virginia, with his 67 Camaro. Currently on the Carolina No Time Production side. Jay Norris, the OK sales and recycling side of the racetrack. Thou advantage for Thompson. He'll have your win light. Nine thou difference. We do have a couple more pair coming shortly. Once again, we got a couple more pairs coming at you very shortly. Dawson Wiggins and Drew Marr. Dawson dialed in a 582 in the Nova. Dunn, North Carolina, the home base. Drew Marr, 91S10 dialed, 627.
And Drew Marr turns it red. Wiggins takes the win light. 580 with the three on the 82. Final pair, Corey Griffith. Corey's dial in at a 670 to a 628 for a big bucks Bob, Bob Mullaney. Mays Landing, New Jersey, the home base of Mullaney. Corey Griffith, about a half hour from my house in Alliance, Ohio. Eleven to seven. Two excellent reaction times. Win light. Gonna go to Bob Mullaney. Nine pack for Mullaney. Shutting out Corey Griffith mathematically. Great job by Big Bucks Bob. Quarter finalists, just come right back when you're ready. We will get you paired up. Uh, as long as you win, just keep coming right back, Gamblers Racers. Again, as long as you win, keep coming right back, and we'll. Uh, have that uh, the pairings here in just a couple of minutes. Cutting edge technology, attention to detail, and rigorous testing under race conditions are the principles that make ATI Performance products great. For more than half a century, we've been helping racers like you reach the finish line first. Today, we manufacture a wide range of high performance parts that are track tested and race proven. We're passionate about performance, and we want to make our passion your performance. Get the whole ATI Performance product story at atiracing.com.
Guys, if you win, come right back to the lanes. If you win, just come right back to the lanes. Y'all gonna make me run up the stairs, Mark? Here we go, round number five of our gambler's race. Seven vehicles left. Gonna start out with a pair of Fords. Mark Hunter, Co Covington, Virginia, the Stewart Smokehouse. 72 Pino, gonna be dialed in 748. Versus Tommy Borgia, 754. Hunter, moving in with the Poison Pinto. Can the third pedal get it done again? Tell you, he's gonna need a little bit of luck right now, Mark Hunter. Slight advantage at the start line. It's going to be Hunter down to the semis. Hey, Tommy Borgia, good job tonight, man. Again, stick shifted in the gambler's race. Got himself down to the quarterfinals. Derek Thompson and David Spa. And the red light for Spa. Derek Thompson gonna keep going. 570 on the window goes. 570. Because that's what you're supposed to do, right? Jesse Betterton, 527 dialing versus the 581 for Dawson Wiggins. I run Bob Mullaney in the water waiting. And a red light for Dawson. Better to dead on three. 527 dead three. Again, there's your Byron. Bob Mullaney. Hunter Thompson. Mullaney. And Betterton left over. Hunter Thompson. Huh.
cutting-edge technology, attention to detail, and rigorous testing under race conditions are the principles that make ATI Performance products great. For more than half a century, we've been helping racers like you reach the finish line first. Today, we manufacture a wide range of high-performance parts that are track-tested and race-proven. We're passionate about performance, and we want to make our passion your performance. Get the whole ATI Performance product story at ATIRacing.com. So it's going to be Jesse Betterton with Lane Choice over Mark Hunter and Bob Mullaney with Lane Choice over Derek Thompson in the semis. And those guys can come back as soon as they're ready, if not sooner.
Well, got three of our four back, just waiting on Jesse Betterton. Once he's back, we'll get our semifinalists in our gambler's race paired up and ready to go. Jesse Betterton needs you to the lanes. Jesse, to the lanes, please. Not you, Jesse. Jesse Betterton, we need you to the lanes.
527 dial and Jesse Betterton, Gretna, Virginia. Coming to you on the OK Sales and Recycling side of things. He's going to have a bit of a wait on Mark Hunter and the Poison Pinot. The Stewart Smokehouse Pinot dialed in 748. Three hundreds the advantage. A lot of work. Better to gets the job done. Winlight gonna go to Mark Hunter. Or to Betterton. Mark Hunter gets the semifinal finish. Good job for Mark, man. All the way down to four cars. Who is Jesse Betterton gonna face? Will it be the man they call Big Bucks Bob Mullaney out of Mays Landing, New Jersey? Or is it gonna be Derek Thompson? Dialed in a five at 71 out of White Sulphur Springs, West Virginia. Mullaney waiting impatiently, gonna knock it deep. So the rent a ride, Mullaney's usually in a rent a ride. When you're that good, you can rent just about anything you want. Derek Thompson got the car in October. Tell you that is a sweet Camaro. It's gonna be Derek Thompson, and boy, Mulaney is gonna be unhappy with himself on this one. So how about this, folks? Our gambler's race gonna come down to a couple of five-second door cars off the foot. Derek Thompson and Jesse Betterton. Cutting edge technology, attention to detail, and rigorous testing under race conditions are the principles that make ATI Performance products great. For more than half a century, we've been helping racers like you reach the finish line first. Today, we manufacture a wide range of high performance parts that are track tested and race proven. We're passionate about performance, and we want to make our passion your performance. Get the whole ATI Performance product story at atiracing.com.
So folks, again, a couple of quick reminders as we wait for Jesse Betterton and Derek Thompson to come on back for our final. Again, tomorrow morning at 11 o'clock, the racers, oh, the, excuse me, Godspeed Ministries uh, church service will be in the grandstands down there. Uh, Renee and Gary will usually be down there pretty early, music playing and getting things ready. Uh, that'll start at 11 o'clock. Registration's going to open up at 10 o'clock. Please and thank you. Absolutely no race engines fired before noon. Um, we will uh, be very quietly giving you guys some reminders over the PA uh, early on as far as how things are going. Again, we've got to keep it pretty quiet because of the got a couple of churches within a pretty close proximity of here, and I don't want to be part of their sermon. I'm not that good. I have some best losing package stuff to give away, some from today, some from yesterday. Eric Amon won a case of ATI Performance Products Super F, ATF uh, Fluid. We got uh, Jay Norris. Jay, you had a pretty good day for a bad day. Jay, you uh, won best losing package uh, in the fourth round today. Got a Jones Transmission Cooling System $200 certificate and for your one pack earlier today, Jay Norris, congratulations, you won a uh, certificate for a super damper courtesy of ATI Performance Products. Great job, man. So that's Jay Norris there. So Jay, you got a couple prizes up here. Bobby Matera, you won the Buy Run Award, DragRaceSolutions.com Buy Run Award for today. Uh, $200 gift certificate to them. Uh, Carson Robbins, best losing package earlier today, got him a $250 Mosier gift certificate. Still got Ernie Humes from yesterday because Ernie never comes up here and collects them till the last second. Um, $300 best losing package certificate to Noah Pollard. That's up here. And finally, a uh, $50 gift certificate we uh, put together yesterday for Chris Dixon, and it's still here. So all those are up here, and uh, I will hold on to them. If you don't get up here tonight, oh, yeah, and Tommy Midget. We have a California car cover glass cleaner. Is that Tommy? Yep, Tommy Midget. We have a California cover glass cleaner kit up here for you as well so we have all those i'll kind of remind you of them tomorrow maybe uh if you don't get up here tonight you can come on up here tomorrow uh in the morning i'll be here probably 9 30 or 10 o'clock and i gotta be quiet so i'll need something to do
And as soon as Jesse gets back, once Jesse Betterton is back, we will run our final in our gambler's race. That's a gentle hint, Jesse.
Well, folks, here comes our final, final of the day. The Gamblers race. Jesse Betterton and Derek Thompson. Section G has shrunken greatly. Here comes your final, Derek Thompson. White Sulphur Springs, West Virginia, the 67 Camaro, dialed in a 571 up against Jesse Betterton. Gretna, Virginia, dialed in a 527. Couple of very beautiful, very fast Camaros. Betterton moving in on the OK sales and recycling side. Derek Thompson on the Carolina no time promotion side. Both of them flicker them on. Big time starting line advantage for the man from West Virginia. Thompson going to be your winner. Derek Thompson, 18, dead seven. Betterton dead on with an eight, but a little bit later on the let go. Congratulations, Derek Thompson, your winner. Tonight's uh, Saturday Night Gamblers race here at the St. Patrick's Triple Ten foot break. Uh, yeah, foot break triple tens, that's it. I'm losing context at this point. <laughs> ATI Performance Products Saturday, what a great day of racing. We got three races finished today. The Friday night race finished today. The Friday night race, race uh, finished today with Nick Hastings winning. And then Saturday night race finished with Bobby Matera winning. And then the gamblers race getting finished up with the winner, Derek Thompson. Folks, once again, just a quick reminder before we shut everything down. No race engines fired before noon tomorrow. Uh, we are at about 10.30 at 11 o'clock. Uh, it's quiet time here. Definitely need to uh, keep that thing quiet. So uh, also the Godspeed Ministry service will be at 11 a.m. Uh, registration will open at 10 tomorrow, but uh, we are gonna be done here for the night. So ladies and gentlemen, y'all have a good night. And uh, catch you again tomorrow. Have a good night, everybody.
Cutting edge technology, attention to detail, and rigorous testing under race conditions are the principles that make ATI Performance products great. For more than half a century, we've been helping racers like you reach the finish line first. Today, we manufacture a wide range of high performance parts that are track tested and race proven. We're passionate about performance, and we want to make our passion your performance. Get the whole ATI Performance product story at ATIRacing.com.